Secondo. Thank you, Mr Speaker. I must admit I'm surprised to hear Mr Nash supporting this bill because he's normally one of the members of the Labor Party who likes to see himself as one of their more commercially savvy members. And what is important to note is that this actually cuts across what I would have thought to be a principle that he would have believed in, and that was the importance of the independence of the fund managers in New Zealand. Because, so let's be under no misapprehension. This particular bill, which I think is a bizarre contribution uh, from the Green Party, would effectively ban public fund managers of the New Zealand Superannuation Fund, the ACC Fund and the Government Superannuation Fund from investing in companies which are directly involved in the mining and production of fossil fuels. Well, so we have always not only valued but really upheld the importance of the independence of these publicly managed funds. And I think one of the really important things for us to take on board is that these particular managed funds are regarded as some of the, some of the models internationally. They are amongst the most ethical sovereign investment funds in the world at the moment. And they have shown how to make good returns while maintaining these high ethical standards. And these high ethical standards do include a genuine respect for sustainability and the best environmental practice. So here we have a bill that is effectively about the Green Party saying, let's just secrete all the funds into our pet projects, because that would actually be the end result of what they're wanting to do here tonight, and take away the independence of some very experienced, commercially astute fund managers. Well, sir, I for one think that that is an outrageous suggestion. It would not serve the interests of our environment. It certainly wouldn't serve the interests of our economy, and I cannot support this bill. I call Reno Tedesco.